Free speech nowadays tends to basically be equated with social and legal cover for alt-right assholery. I don't think anyone would say that the modern American right is characterized by a commitment to the liberal arts values of vigorously disagreeing using the tools of evidence and logic against your political enemies. Guys like Milo have created monopolies on the linguistic territory related to free speech. But I think even a guy like that does serve a purpose on college campuses. Because what he's betting is, even things that are obviously morally and intellectually repellent, the standard issue liberal activist on a college campus can't even respond to that based upon logic and evidence. That it's kind of like a parry move to indicate intellectual weakness in his adversaries. I think it's useful to have a guy like that on campus, even if I think that he's repugnant and potentially a cancer on American political discourse.